she was in fact kidnapped, held uh, at gunpoint and forced uh, by threat to obtain and carry drugs back to Lima. She wasn't offered any money. She was threatened and held. Now, she is now prepared and ready to give full details to the police who are in a, in a, a questioning process. And once that, once that questioning process is over, then the, the result of the questions, the questions and answers go to the judge. There is a presiding judge who will then decide whether or not there's a prima facie case. And that'll probably be next week, possibly Tuesday or Wednesday. So Michaela is denying any wrongdoing. Uh, Melissa has already been, and she's in, the, she's in the process of being questioned during this questioning procedure. And that's about wrap, wrapping up now. So then Michaela will be, will be questioned the same process. I, I think there is hope. But it depends very much on the prosecuting authorities here as to whether or not they're going to do this in a fair way. Because the process here seems to be that uh, once, once you're charged, there's no bail in, the, in, the, in, the, in, these, procedures, in these type of uh, offences. There is no bail. And she will have to go to trial. <laughs>